Okay. Here's the lesson. This nation Congress, will July 4th, 1776. Because I, 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 I do not very well myself. We all have the tools to be self-evident. The source of human identity is not necessary for one people to dissolve the political bands which have connected them with another and to assume among the powers of the earth the separate and equal station to which the laws of nature and of nature's God entitle them. The decent respect to the opinions of mankind requires that they should declare the People want to tear it down. We ought to just live up <laughs> to it instead of tearing it down. And we didn't that live up to it. So my answer to that, that question, how do you get better than the Bill of Rights, is you read the Declaration of Independence. The pursuit of happiness that to secure these rights Governments are instituted among men, the deriving their just powers when, from the consent of the, the governed that whenever any form of government becomes, becomes necessary of these one ends, people it is the right of the people the to alter or to abolish it, and to institute another, new government, laying its foundation on such principles and organizing its powers in such form, as to them shall seem most likely to affect like their the separate, safety and happiness. Separate. Like that whole indeed will dictate that governments long established should not be changed for light and transient causes just and accordingly all experience has shown that mankind are more disposed to suffer while evils are sufferable than Christian to right themselves by abolishing the forms to which they are accustomed. That I but when a long train of abuses and usurpations <laughs> and pursuing invariably see, the same object right, evinces a light, design to reduce them under absolute despotism, in of it is their right. It is their duty to C &E, throw off such government said, and to provide e new guards M for their future security. Such so has been the patient e sufferance the of these colonies. And, and such is now the necessity which M constrains them to alter their former systems know, of government. The, the history of the, the present of king of Great Britain the, is a the history of, of repeated injuries and usurpations, but if you all having in direct object the establishment of an absolute tyranny over these that states. That all men are created to equal. To prove this, you were born a little girl, a world. and you heard this in your head being recited. You are literally, truthfully, mindfully going to answer me back. that you don't see how this sounds just really anti any of these things like what I'm, what sexist I'm you know like how women would just feel like other people's children if you're gay and you can't have kids, yeah i mean you know, all why men do you are not believe it's your right to go to other people's their kids kids. you know so it's just like if you were a woman, You've if I was a woman, and I heard like that all men, I would just kind of zone out, just like, okay, well, all men, your decision, I'm a woman, right? it doesn't You've decided that having sex with women is Now a we're in a time where... Fine, your decision is your Not that they the were, you know, it's just... To go to other families, women want to be recognized their children. as Leave them equals alone. to men. As transgender as you like. Don't come Which talk to my kids about it. Another... Or less I raised them. I paid them. Like I said, my kid. you don't see kid. this. You I'm not the government's kid. I'm not you can't put yourself in the shoes of just growing up, not Frank the little boy, but maybe Francine, you know, Frank's unknown twin sister, thinking, you know, just put yourself in that thought experiment. Get rid of the Nazi. <laughs> the argument if you want to just you know come with me because i will destroy that nazi <laughs> perspective and i don't want to do it like i would a heckler when i was doing comedy you know frank like just i hope that this kind of just helps you see with your eyes what my father told me that there's a lot of keys to, you know, becoming successful, but there are three tips that a man must watch out for if, when, or the if, they, you know, like, he told me that these three tips are the tip of your pen, the tip of your tongue, and the tip of your... manhood let's just say that and my father like the lord and savior always taught me in these metaphors just like this 
I was, you know, I'm sure everybody can understand each one. The tip of your pen. Watch what you sign. Especially watch what you're writing. Or, you know, now it's just like if you say to kids, you know, like, give me a pen. There's going to be a day when kids are going to be like, what is a pen? Because everything is just paperless. You know, it's just all typing. So it's just like you got to understand that language isn't this. It's like, like how to, you know, and this is where I worry myself because I've caught myself. There was a Family Guy episode where, you know, it's just a quick thing where it's like a grandpa just like turning off a, a little lampstand like on and off and the kids are just like, and the grandpa's just like, are you kidding me? When I first saw this at the World's Fair, I nearly crapped myself. <laughs> it's like that where it's just like, kids don't know just how blown away like my generation, I'm the millennials. So Generation X, you know, Generation Z has no idea. You know, like they're, it's like I have no idea what an eight track looks like. I've heard of it. I've seen it on, I guess, like, you know, movies, but it's just like I've never seen one, you know, and I, I would reference to like my my future generations like if you know like CDs and then how it went to like MP3 like there was this little blip in the middle called like mini discs <laughs> you know my friend was just like this is going to be the future man it's like no skipping it's just like yeah but it's but this you know like it was just it was cool it was cool for the time, but then when Apple came out, and then like everybody was just trying to copy Apple. I don't know where I'm really going with this analogy, but I'm just, I'm just saying, Frank. Like everything you are saying, if you just do what I'm doing here, like Bible, like Scripture, and go back and look at what at fifty-eight thirty-two on. On the book of CRT versus Christianity, written by, you know, Frank Turek, Dr. Frank Turek, or Rabbi Frank Turek, or Pharisee Frank Turek, or how about just Brother Frank, or, <laughs> you know, Frank. <laughs> To be self-evident that all men are created equal and endowed by their creator with certain unalienable rights among these are life, liberty, and pursuit of happiness, and that governments are instituted among men to secure these rights. Amen. How do you get better than the Bill of Rights? You don't. Know.